What's up guys? I am so excited to be here today uh, because I'm at my house filming a video with Zeiss and Rocket. Zeiss and Rocket Jump. It's a VFX heavy shoot where the floor fills with lava. It's insane. So let's go take a look and see what it looks like inside. Welcome to my house. So we're simulating the light for real because that's really hard to do in post. Right. This combined right. with yeah. the yeah. visual effect, it's gonna look, it's gonna look, it's gonna look real good. Gotcha. There's no rhyme or reason to the way lava lights. It just kind of organically shoots up light. So we don't gotta do much once we got all the units down. Do I have experience with lava? Not so much. You, you should have said I have a lava experience. Oh man. So for the shoes, Ice has uh, donated five different CP3 XD lenses. The CP3 lenses are giving you shading and distortion data in real time. Basically, we're bringing the tools that $300 million budget films use to make it available to someone like you. <laughs> That's the whole idea. <laughs> With a VFX intensive short like this, if the first time you're getting together is on day one of set, then you're gonna be moving a lot slower. So we had a test day and we all came in and rehearsed out the scenes, get the pacing, the rhythm, the flow of everything together. And we would talk like, I was thinking this, I was thinking this. And it's just a good way to get on the same page before you jump in on the day. All right, I think it's about shooting time. Let's do this. Had to record that. So there's a sequence in the short where Carl has to climb the crown molding. How prepared are you not to land on that light? About, about 85%. percent be about 100% for you to do that. <laughs> about 85. Oh man. <sighs> oh fuck. You okay? You okay? You okay? Yeah. Sorry, okay. No, 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 no. Do you, do, I'm gonna cut. Yeah. Yeah. Just yeah. rest sure dude. Oh my god! You got that? Oh uh, yeah! Uh, let's, let's see playback. Oh! Okay. Yeah. Okay. Chalk dries out your hands so that you're not sweaty and slipping off the walls, which is what happened. Yeah, that's the one. All right. Move on. That was awesome. You know, anything to get the shot, you just gotta power through and take the break. Everyone falls in it. Yep. Let, yeah, let's just go from the chant. So through and through, tried and true, through and through. Do you have things you like to do as a director? Like tricks you have? Secret directions are what's up because one, you don't want the actor worrying that if they don't hit the direction, everyone on the crew and everyone on set is gonna notice and like judge. It's just between you guys. Nobody else can tell what the direction was. Yeah, go, 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 go! Run! Other reason is so the act other actor doesn't hear it, you know? You leave it on the one actor to affect the other actor. So it makes it a bit more natural, I think. We need each other! Uh, Brett, that was great, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah that, that was exactly what I was looking for. Right. Uh, cutting! Cutting! We're back, guys. Day two, or night two, rather. I'm getting to ride a corpse to safety today, so that's what we're filming. We are gonna put Brett up on this dolly track right here, actually. Um, and we have a wooden board that we're gonna lay across it so we can just rest peacefully, you know, as if you were deceased. And then I'm going to sit down on his body and uh, surf across the lava to safety. That's it, man. It's ridiculous. What does lava sound like? It sounds like a lot of stock library effects. <laughs> Let's break down for the night. Let's uh, thank you all. That's a wrap for today. Thank you so much, everybody. What you need, Cam? Just your smile and a wink. Can't wink. Can't wink without my. Mouth. Right.
So today is our third and final day for this lava video. We're shooting three scenes and we're getting a number of pickups. We're actually shooting during the day today as opposed to night. We're having to black out all of the windows so that when we do look at the windows, it still looks like it's night outside. Uh, I'd like to note that uh, currently we have a uh, DP, a gaffer, a first AC, and talent uh, duving out the windows. Every hand counts. So we're getting a shot that's a little too cramped for the red. So we're going with the A7R. Uh, raw? Okay. Yeah, for sure. Uh, oh yeah. Nice. Yeah, that's it. Great. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Ah! Ah! Oh! 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 Moving on. Yeah, moving on. Moving on. Uh, the book was to uh, give a little return from our lighting. You can use a little bit of white. We just needed something slight, and we are in a very small, very small room. So sometimes you gotta improvise. Books, hats, slates, whatever, uh, whatever gets the job done. <laughs> yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's a wrap. Woo! Woo! Ah, yeah. But it was a, it was a lot of hard work. But I really appreciate it because you uh, you make my dreams come true. Yeah. Kevin Sinzaki. <laughs> Good man. Um, this is the biggest cashew I've ever seen. What's up, y'all? We are in the post production phase of The Floor is Lava. And as you can see behind me, the floor is indeed lava. We got a lot of rotoscoping to do, we have a lot of track matting to do. So let's talk about it. The first thing I'm gonna do is since there's camera movement, I'm gonna track this thing. 3D camera tracker on there. We're gonna do a thing called a track mat where you roto it once, you apply that mask to your tracked null. It should just work out and you don't have to rotoscope anything. So the lava. This lava is also a black solid with a, a fractal noise effect. Once I have that, first thing I'm gonna add displacement map. From there, you're gonna invert it. Next, a colorama effect. That's when we start getting the lava look. This next part is awesome. I'm using a Red Giant plugin. It's called Light Wrap. That does so much. I mean, the rest of it is just kind of compositing it. The only thing we're missing is fire and smoke, and you're getting your final effect here. Guys, it has been a blast. Uh, I appreciate you watching this BTS, taking the time for that. If you hadn't already, check out The Floor is Lava Short. You have a great day. My name's Clinton Jones. Check me out on Instagram or Twitter or MySpace. You know, if you're still on that life. Thanks for watching. Special thanks to Zeiss for making this video possible and providing the CP3 lenses, which you see throughout the behind the scenes. Our podcast, Story Break, we're switching over to audio only, and you can listen to it at storybreak.rockjump.com.